So that leaves me with my net take home at What's good, y'all boys? In this video, we're gonna be going over my first paycheck working with Gordon Food Service, so let's get to it. Before we get started, though, if you're new to the channel, make sure you hit the subscribe button right now and make sure you smash that like button because it really helps out in the algorithm. Go ahead and do that right now. Okay, so before we jump into the pay stub, I kind of want to go over a few things. First of all, I am in training, so keep that in mind. And uh, pay differs between how long you've been in the company. So obviously, someone that's training is gonna have different pay from someone that's been there, you know, years or even a few more months than I have. First things first, training you get paid daily a certain rate, which is 250 per day. Keep that in mind, 250 per day. Also, when it comes to the benefits, people choose different type of health insurance plans, dental plans. Uh, and a whole bunch of other type of savings and different type of extra insurance that you don't even need to get into But some people actually choose those extra coverages. So just keep that in mind All right, so back to the 250 per day while you're training that only counts when you've been there for around seven hours of the day and if you guys haven't seen my last video make sure you go watch that right now i go a little bit into depth so there's gonna be a paycheck going from monday to friday monday i stayed a full day tuesday i stayed a full day wednesday and thursday i stayed half a day and friday i stayed a full day so that's gonna be three full days and two half days so for those three days i got paid 250 each day and then for the other two days i got paid around 125 and if you add that up you're gonna see that it equals to a thousand dollars flat now another thing to keep in mind is that there is a minimum working with gfs you will never get less than $1,100 gross. Remember, gross. So this $1,100 without taking taxes or you know all your benefits like the insurance, none of that off your check. Just remember that $1,100, that's your gross minimum you will ever get working with GFS. So now that that's out the way, I got $1,000, but they're gonna bump it up to $1,100 because that's the minimum. So let's jump straight into the pay stubs. All right, so as you can see up in the top, it's $1,100 gross, which I told you was the minimum you will ever get working with GFS. You will never see a check lower than that. Next, you're gonna see taxes and deductions. As you can see, they took away $191 out of my check, which $16 is from the Medicare, which is my insurance plan. And then the rest is gonna be, you know, the state taxes and all that, yada, yada, yada. So that leaves me with my net take home at $908.71. That is going to be my minimum check ever. So for those of you guys getting your CDL and not sure what job you're gonna get into, this is the type of money that you're gonna be looking at if you start working with GFS. If you wanna know more about working with GFS, make sure you take a look at that last video I posted. I go more into depth about how the job is and all that. If you wanna see that, make sure you go check it out. So yeah, like I said, $908.71. That's gonna be the lowest amount that I will ever get with GFS after taxes and everything take home. That's the lowest. And that's because of those two half days. If not, I would have reached 1250 in the whole week. I would have been at 1250, then they would have taken away tax from there. I would have been looking at at least a thousand, not 900. So keep that in mind. I also go over those half days and why they happened in my last video. So if you want to check it out, like I said, go ahead. So if you guys are willing to put in that work for some good money, GFS is a great route to take. I highly recommend it. Take a look at my last video for more information about it and what exactly I go through on a day-to-day -day basis. If you have any questions, make sure you leave them down in the comments. Like this video, like I said, if you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button. I'll be answering hella questions. I'll be talking more about, you know, the pay and the job and all that. So if you like the content, really do make sure you subscribe. It's your boy Yad and I'll see you on the next one.